All righty, guys, I have a really packed construction update for you, okay? I have 2023, the current year. I have the two rides I'm going to update you on. I have 2025 slash 2027 that we're going to talk about, okay? This massive plot of land that keeps growing. It is so large, this surveyed plot of land. I don't even know where to begin. Like, I am so confused. This is definitely a multi-year project that's about to begin, but the size of this coaster... Okay, there is obvious markings for a coaster, and the size of it is massive. The infrastructure prep work that they're doing in the area, insanely massive. I don't even know where to begin. It's, it's crazy. So let's begin with Kingswood. Kingswood has survey markings in it, behind it, beside it, around it. It's completely being surveyed, and it is starting to show some electrical flags and a few stakes already. If you start seeing stakes, that's when you got to start questioning some things. Some electrical infrastructure work has started to take place behind Chicken Shack. They've installed this temporary diesel um, generator. I don't know if this is the one that powers the ice rink, so please take this with a grain of salt. But if that diesel generator is there, it could be to power the main park line. Now, I do have a feeling that is the ice rinks power generator. So if anyone knows that and could comment down below, I'm going to leave that as that's the current option. I will say, though, it looks brand new. Um, so we'll just keep that in the playing cards. But they have started using this... Um, sensitive drill i forget what it's called i'll just call it that it basically they use water to drill into the earth so they don't um cut any power lines and all that um so here the you see they're about to put this little like dig cutout thing in the ground and they're going to dig it out there's been surveying work through kingswood beside behemoth in action zone and now they've been heading on over uh to the flight deck area and time warp area this is a very large pot of land um, the really confusing part is if it's going to be for 2025 or 2027. I don't think Frontier Canada is done, so I've been saying that this is going to be for 2027, uh, as they usually survey about three to four years ahead of time. However, they could be surveying if it's a large expansion. So, for example, they start renovating Action Zone uh, before they add the coaster, and they need that measurement now. So this could make sense. Um, Snoopy's Racing Railway is quickly wrapping up. Um, they're doing a lot of the final touches now. A lot of it has to do with landscaping, insulation, um, and stuff like that. So definitely wrapping up the final details. Hopefully this ride will be open May 19th as well. Um, they have been running cycles, so don't worry. The ride is still getting ready. They're not that far behind from opening day. I think a lot of us have been really hard on Wonderland. But it's still um, in pretty good timing considering the weather they had the last three weeks. Um, and any... Um, of the construction supplies uh, delays that they would have had as well. Um, I know that was one of the things that affected Tundra Twister. Um, I speculate that uh, one of the parts was delayed in shipping. Now, Tundra Twister, it is quickly wrapping up, okay? You should see test cycles tomorrow, okay? Hopefully tomorrow. I know they're about to lay down some concrete, so that might delay the test cycles a little bit, but I'm speculating that this ride will be starting to do some actual full testing either Thursday or Friday. So stay tuned for that. They are literally almost done. The brickwork is done, and now they're putting up the fence. The elevator is going in um, on the exit side of the platform, and they laid down the little stones that they lay down before pouring some concrete. So they are literally almost done. Tundra Twister is literally... <laughs> Why am I saying literally so much? Oh my god, why am I saying literally like that as well? Ew! Um, but nonetheless... Oh man, I'm going to hate myself when I listen back to this. Um, a lot is going on. Um, so Timberwolf Falls is wrapping up, putting back together uh, the lift hill. It has two new chains installed and some brand new wood that will go on it as well. So Timberwolf Falls received a lot of love over this offseason. But yeah, thank you so much for watching today's construction update. Hopefully you enjoyed it. There are going to be daily or two to three construction updates a week moving forward. This is a very large project and expansion that Canada's Wonderland is under. Thanks for watching, guys. See you at the park. Bye.